Hello, you're welcome to South Africa. This is Muhammad Jamia. In this video, I'll be showing you how you can best explore the South Africa learning app, the new app which just launched. From creating an account, setting up your profile, and enrolling in courses and more. So just watch me as I walk you through each of these steps. So in this video, I'll be taking you to how you can create your first account with just your phone number. That's really amazing. So let's jump in. The first thing is you go to your browser. So my first browser is uh, Google Chrome. I think you also use that as well. So input into your browser, SciAfrica.com. SciAfrica.com. So you should ensure that it's K. Sci and Africa, K, not C. So once you input that into your browser search bar, then click open. So, so this is South Africa uh, website. These are main website. These are beautiful website. So it's on this website that is going to lead you to our learning app. So you could see this button at the left side and go now. So this is the button you are going to click on to lead you to the app. So click on and go now. It is loading. Amazing. You could see that this is our app. It looks a bit different, a bit uh, different from what you've seen in the website. So the first step is to create your account, just like you set up your Facebook account, your WhatsApp and every other thing. The same process also applies there. So since you don't have an account for the first time, you click on sign up. You click on sign up. So in this, you input your phone number. You only need your phone number to create an account on South Africa. That's really amazing. So to input your phone number, follow the same pattern you see on the screen. So don't remove the first zero from your phone number. Just start with, if your number starts with 070, remove the first zero and start with 70. If it's 090, remove the first zero and start with 90. So I'll be inputting my phone number now so that I can obtain a code that is an OTP for you to proceed. So I have entered my number into into the into the into the uh into the box. My number starts with zero nine zero. You could see that I removed the first zero and started with nine zero. So don't make that mistake. Don't make that mistake. Don't put the first zero. Remove the first zero and enter input your number. So once you input this, click on agree to terms of service and privacy policy. Then you click on sign up. So once you click on the sign up button, it's going to a OTP and OTP code is going to be sent to your phone. So you should say you should see it on your text message in a few seconds. Now I have my OTP. My OTP has been sent to me to my text message. So you just copy that OTP and you type it, or you can Type it with your keyboard. You can see that OTP, I've copied it. It is 6159698. So I'll just paste it. So once you input your phone number and click on sign up, an OTP is going to be sent to your phone. So once you do this and input the OTP, click on verify. Verification successful. So the next step is you setting up your password. So I will set up my password and you should also do the same when you are, when you are uh, entering, when you are creating an account for the first time. I've input my password. Now the next thing is I will click on set password button. You should ensure that your password is at least six characters. That is six characters, either numbers or either alphanumeric or just alphabet. Don't just input four numbers like your bank account. It should be at least six. So you click on set password. Amazing. I've created my account successfully. The next thing now is for me to log in. So I'll be logging in with my phone number and the password. So let me input that. I've input my phone number and the password. The next thing is for you to log in. Login successful. That's very pretty easy. So now that you've created your, uh, your account, the first thing before you start Thinking of enrolling in courses or start learning on the app, you need to complete your profile. The first step is that you created an account with just your phone number and the password. The next step is 
completing your profile. It is when you complete your profile, you have the full access to the platform and you can also see recommendation of courses, of courses you should enroll in. So if you are in SS1, you're going to see SS1 courses. If you're in SS2, you're going to see SS2 courses depending on your class. So let's click on OK. So I'll be completing all this process. So you should also do the same. You've already your first name. You know, in the sign up, you don't input your first name. Put your first name, your last name, your phone number, email address, your parent phone number, the preferred language you wanted to learn in. For now, we only support Yoruba and other other languages are going to be released very soon. So you should, if you are not a Yoruba speaking student, then you have to wait till we have courses on other languages. But if you are a Yoruba speaking student, just click on Yoruba Air. And we also just, we are only supporting three classes for now, SS1 to SS3. We also plan of supporting other students in lower classes uh, in, in, near, in near future. But for now, we focus on the high school student, that is the senior secondary school student. Just click on your class. If you're in SS2, SS3, complete that. Input your Uber, your print phone numbers, your email address, your first name. And after you are done with all that, you click on save changes. You click on save changes. Once you are done with that, that is perfect. You've successfully created an account and you've completed your profile. So the next step is enrolling in courses. See you in the next video.